Okay, the manicure I have today is uh, OPI. Two different colors. I put three layers of this shade on my nails. Uh, the color number. And this one's called Don't Talk Back to Me, or Bach to Me. It's NLG17 is the color number, and it's from TJ Maxx. Got it for $3.99. Uh, I put three coats on. Today it was a little bit streaky. Usually I can get away with two coats with this manicure. Uh, the other color I have here is... I'll, I'll tinsel you in, and it's HR um, F15. And this is a chunky confetti type polish, and I usually wear it with this as the base coat, the the sort of this sort of green as the base coat. But I've done it with other sort of pastel tones. And usually, I only need one coat of the chunky color to go over top and it usually ends up putting pretty good coverage over at that point. If you want to uh, do more coats, it does layer more confetti on. If you want the white uh, squares to show up, usually it takes more than one coat. The little black specks and the little white lines come out first usually. For some reason it's harder to get the white, the little white squares to fall on the nail. These are two of my favorite OPI colors that I have so far. I don't have very many OPI colors, but I'll be expanding my OPI collection. It's one of my favorite brands so you know that I've tried so far. We have a limited availability of it where I live, so I'll probably have to order some. This, These two colors, though, again, I got at TJ Maxx on sale, probably about $3.99 for each bottle this spring. The green color is sort of a shimmer opaque. There's just an ever so slight metallic shimmer in it. That shows up more in the bottle than on the nail. But basically that's it. Uh, this is a nail polish combo. This manicure I pretty much wear on a regular day-to-day -day basis. It might not be for everyone, but I do like it. I find it to be kind of a unique... Might be a good look for someone who's looking for kind of a retro look. Kind of reminds me of something from the 80s. <laughs> Thank you for watching.